Hello there and welcome to a very special video on the new talent of FBB YouTube channel. Um, as you can see from your screen, I'm going to be previewing my top five female bodybuilders that I'm going to look out for in 2022. Um, so these are five women, as you can see from the picture there, who are not in the same um, categories in terms of competing. Um, so I'm not going to be comparing them to each other. Uh, they are just five different athletes that I'm excited to follow in 2022 um, and watch them progress. So starting off in no particular order with Alicia Hackett. She is someone who I featured very recently on the channel. Um, and not only am I excited to see her progress physique wise, but she's actually a very, very, very lovely person. Um, and she was incredibly touched to be featured on the channel. Um, and we've had some back and forth about that and I've really enjoyed getting to know her a little bit. Um, she's just graduated college really recently, so she'll be able to focus on her bodybuilding a little bit more in 2022. Um, and she is a wellness athlete, in, which is a division that is absolutely booming at the moment. Um, so I can't wait to see her progress um, in 2022. She's a really lovely woman, well worth a follow, really awesome physique. Um, so there is her handle right there, Alicia Wellness MPC. As always, um, direct links to these women's Instagrams will be in the video description. Um, so she is well worth a follow and I cannot wait to see what she brings to the stage in 2022. Next up is Kali Almondine, another woman who I featured um, this year on the channel. She is an IFBB pro from Switzerland. So as you can see, um, she's got quite a different physique to Alicia, who I mentioned just now. And she's definitely the biggest out of all the women that I'm featuring in this video. But I just think she's such an impressive specimen. Um, I'm really looking forward to seeing what she brings to the stage in 2022. Um, she just has immense muscle um, and I'm really, really looking forward to seeing how she progresses next year. So if you'd like to give her a follow, there she is, at Kali underscore Amandine. Um, give her a follow, like up her photo. She posts quite a lot of actual training videos, so well worth a follow, if, especially if you're into the bigger um, women. Um, and if even if you're a woman looking to compete in this division, look no further than Collie Amandine. Next up is Ashton Penny. Absolutely love her handle, A Lucky Penny. Um, there it is for you on the screen at A Lucky Penny. I think it's such a clever name. Um, she is also a wellness competitor. She actually turned pro this year, so it's a really, really exciting year for her, 2021. Um, she is a flight attendant by trade, um, so. She quite lives quite an interesting life. Like obviously travels a little bit. Obviously she's curbed a little bit internationally with COVID and everything. Um, but hopefully she's able to get back to that in 2022. But I'm really, really looking forward to seeing what she brings to the pro stage. She is someone who has earned everything that she's got in the bodybuilding world. Um, and she is an incredibly beautiful woman, um, incredibly aesthetic physique. Um, and I'm really looking forward to seeing her go on to even bigger and better things next year. Next is Spanish athlete Julia Fernandez um, at Julia underscore Sanchez FDEZ. So Julia Sanchez. Um, she is a Spanish bodybuilder who's made incredible progress this year and I cannot wait to see what she brings next year. Um, she's kind of competed between divisions in the past, figure and wellness. I'm not sure she's necessarily settled on a particular division, but I think she most recently competed in figure. So I imagine that is the route that she'll be going. So it'll be interesting to see what she does next year. And finally, last but not least, remember in no particular order for this bit is Nadia Ailas. I featured her really really recently she's just 21 years old um, at the lifting latina again very very cool handle i think it's so important to get like a real niche handle there it can really help with people trying to follow you so at the lifting latina again this will a direct link to this will be in the video description so do not worry about writing this down or anything enjoy the video and click on these women's profiles afterwards um, she actually competed most recently out of all the women that I featured. She was competing right up until Christmas. Um, shows you the dedication there, competing in a very, very tricky period uh, dieting wise. So she's someone who's well worth a follow as well. Looking forward to seeing what she does next year. She was a wellness competitor. She's actually switched over to physique, um, to figure, sorry, most recently. Um, and as you can see from just those images there, I think it really, really suits her um, body makeup. So it'd be really interesting to see what she brings to the stage next year. Okay, without further ado, let the countdown begin.
Okay, I hope you enjoyed uh, the feature of those five women, my top five bodybuilders to look out for in 2022. Here is a final recap of numbers one to five. Um, remember, just my opinion, and I'm not comparing the women to each other. Some of them compete in completely different categories, have completely different physical compositions. It is just five women who I'm excited to see progress in 2022. So just to recap, in fifth place, Julia Sanchez. In fourth place, Nadia Ilas. In third place, Alicia Hackett in second place Collie Armandine and in first place Ashton Penny so mainly um, gone with Ashton Penny for number one simply because um, how she turned pro this year I just think she made immense progress throughout the year and I'm really excited to see um, if she can make a dent in the wellness division um, on the pro stage so that's mainly why I'm most excited to see her and why I've put her number one in terms of Kali Omandine, I think she has the most impressive physique in terms of size, so I'm very excited to see kind of how far she pushes herself. Um, number three, Alicia Hackett. I think she's got a beautiful physique for the wellness division. I've really enjoyed getting to know her as well, um, and I think she can go as far as she wants to go. I think she has a fantastic physical makeup for the wellness division. Fourth place, Nadia Ailas. Um, as I mentioned earlier, she competed most recently out of these women, um, and I think she has a beautiful makeup for figure. I think she's made a sensible decision switching from wellness to figure and I think she'll make waves there and then uh, finally Julia Sanchez I mentioned she made incredible progress this year and I'm really interested to see where she takes her physique moving forward guys let me know in the comments um, if you're excited about the featured women for 2022 or let me know what other body what other bodybuilders you're excited to see in 2022 i'm always on the lookout for exciting talent hence the name of the channel new talents of female bodybuilding let me know in the comments who you're excited for and why um, and let's get chatting have a fantastic 2022 all the best